The Angel Family Farm in Davie County is surrounded by color. It's pretty nice out through there. A swirl of bright colors cover a nearby water tower. Bright red azaleas are in bloom. It's pollinating. Even the dark green of wheat stands out. Yeah. But those colors don't compare to what's in this field. Working real nice. It's his newest crop. Well, this is the uh, rainfall seed, but it's a flower garden to me sometimes sitting here as I'm getting a little bit older. In the spring, the blooms of the rape seed are bright yellow. It's been nice all last week. Madison Angel passes the time watching the golden carpet sway in the breeze. It's nice. And following the bees as they hop from flower to flower. These little old honeybees are doing the job. Sometimes the piece is broken. But Angel doesn't mind. A lot of people stop and take pictures of it. And last week, uh, there was a few people here with a photographer wanting to take pictures and wedding pictures out in it. The 40 acres of land will remain a bright eye popping yellow for about another week. Then it will slowly begin to fade. But what comes out of the field will last throughout the season. And it's a new, new uh, crop that uh, we extract the oil from it and uh, use it in uh, food wrappers to protect the food from sticking to the wrappers. So your honey buns and sticky buns aren't as sticky because the wrapper is coated with rapeseed oil. Madison Angel hopes other farmers will plant rapeseed. The bright yellow plant isn't tough to grow. That's an interesting crop. Just treat it like the dark green wheat crop. They'll get a little bigger than that. In Davie County, Charles Ewing, Fox 8 News.